There we are uh, for the noisy radio. Of course, new lease construction. Uh, I think it's like a 10 well pad. There's going to be 10 oil wells drilled on this when it's all done. Anyway, we built what a racket, eh? So we built the road. I wasn't involved in that. And then uh, they're just building a turnaround here, and then we'll grab the whole thing in here. Here's Here's the borrow pit for the clay to build the road. And I'm just going in here and I'm dumping. They've got, it's really, really carefully graded. And then we're done, got some fabric stuff down there and then putting gravel on top of that. We'll be putting, I think 12 inches of gravel on this whole location when we get done. Gravel, right. are you turning around for loading? Anyway. That's what it looks like now. Can we use dump spread low or near the perimeter? What do you want? Can't hear you at all. Just put that down the middle like a lot of time. Okay, and then come back spreading the same as. Hey, hey, box raisin. Hey, let's do a little more footage here, see if we can get some. So new access to a dirt new location, brand new road that hasn't got gravel on yet. We're just putting some gravel in the end for a turnaround so that all the trucks can come in here. Spruce, poplar, what's growing around there? Lots of noise on the two-way radio. There's the boral pit for the clay, so it's a pretty big hole. Rock trucks down there, that's a 300. Anyway, we'll see what I get to do as far as unloading and what you, we can see, because it's kind of busy and can't really be holding the phone when I'm unloading, usually. Let's we'll see what he's got. 10 well pad. That's what I heard this is going to be. Oh, it is our dump that just beside me here. <laughs> they clean my hitch off here. This thing will ever zoom in and out. Drive me crazy. Got a little bit of gravel on there. You got to shake that all off, make sure there's nothing to fall off and get everybody. That's the location that we're spreading here anyway. Let me check and see if I close my end gate. Yeah, end gate's closed. Well, we'll check this one. So, latched, everything good. Good to go. There's the location. Spread the gravel on that fabric so that we can uh, not sink in the dirt and so the water drains away. So that's the fourth load of the day. I'm done heading home after the regular check the truck, make sure nothing's wrong and service and everything else for morning and do it all again. So hopefully uh, you guys are doing something fun as well. So thanks for watching and talk to you later. I guess I guess I could show a little bit of the scenery, what this looks like, just in case it's different than what everyone else sees. It is pretty country. 30 loaded. I'm a little curious how much dirt got hauled out of that uh, boro pit there. You know, that rock trick truck down there doesn't look very big compared to the hole. 
So here's that boro pit now that it's all completed and fixed. I would think that's a hundred yards by 50 yards. I don't know how deep that would be. 25, 30 feet. Anyway, that would hold fish now, huh? I would think that probably what will really happen is uh, moose will come and drink there. Anyway, back on the road. <laughs> Yeah, where are you guys at? I'm just at the 5 and 15 access and wait for you. Yeah, there's three of us on one there. There you have it. Now it's time to be done for the day. So thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Noisy radio.